Hey guys, how you doing? Um, this is my next part of my card series here, and this one is going to be titled Dream. And the reason why I have all the scraps here and, and whatnot is that I had cut out these flowers for the girls earlier to make flowers today. And um, I was using the scraps of that to... I was holding them together with these little things here. I was using the scraps for that to um, make some paper tiles like this. Um, so then I can add them to the card. So I'm just been here's another uh, rectangular tile that I'm just cutting the edge off here to make a design on it so it's not just one color. And that's what I'm doing. And I, um, I was like, oh, I want to put tiles on this one. And then I have some, like obviously this is all jelly prints and stuff like that. And I'm going to add them to it so. I mean, it's a little bit more involved in this one, but still, it was like, oh, I'm, I just decided to put tiles, and I'm not going to worry about it too much, and make some um, tile-type things. So, that's what I'm doing. So, I'm taking pieces. I'm going to have square ones as well. Um, and I'm going to put them in here as well. And just ink the edges whatnot and just make some really cool tiles. I did put some stamping on some um, so I'm not sure like if I want to do all of them. just want them to look really unique and so I don't have like a ton of different stamps, but actually I just thought of my, this one here, I like this one, so I can um, ink it up here, because I've got some of the rounder pieces on there, I can ink it up just like that, and get the rounder shape in there that I like, so that'll be nice. Did I not get that one very well? I'm wondering if my ink pad's drying out. <laughs> but anyways, so that's what I'm doing. I'm just going to play with that. So make a few of these and um, put them on there. I know it's dream. I don't know. I just felt like putting some tiles. And so they're kind of like fake tiles, but it's all good. To put on my dream art card. There's my tummies talking. <laughs> so that's what I want to do today. I thought it was really different. Um, this one I got another piece of scrap on there. That one I have one up there. And that's what... I don't know. I'm not sure what tiles have to do with dreams, but maybe it's just popped into my head for a reason, so I'm going to give it a, give it a go. And give it a try. So they're going to be really cute. I'm going to Mod Podge them on. I think I want to put one more square one up here, or maybe a little rectangle got what's kind of like 
Mm, this one might be nice. So, when you have scraps, you can kind of go around on the jelly print pages and cut some squares out and rectangles and uh, play with them. And see what you come up with. Here's a piece of the end that I cut off, and it's just very, very thin strip. So I'm going to paste some of those on there, Mod Podge them on. So that's my different, different one for today. So. I don't know, that's pretty cool. And I'm playing with scraps, using more scraps up, and then I can put these on tiles. This one's the size of a, a domino, so I kind of use those to trace my tiles and dominoes to trace the squares out. So then I can use them for something else after if I wanted to. So, and I don't want to put tiles like uh, domino tiles or game tiles on here because I already have a couple of my cards are getting thick. And I want to fit all ten of them on and not have an issue and not have to take deconstruct one of my cards just so I could get it on. Because my believe card's pretty thick. So I might have to I if I have to, I may have to deconstruct that one and make it as a little less chunky. And this one, like I said, I put a nice little strip. Oh, goodness, you're seeing me, my sweats, and my lovely sweatshirt more than my craft. Sorry, guys. <laughs> um, I'm not going out. That's my day clothes sometimes. I just like to sit around in sweats. Comfy. Oh, this is a nice color. So there's really nice colors in here. And you can put some... I like to ink the edges so it looks nice. I don't know, it just makes it pull it. It pulls it out a little bit more. And this one is kind of going along. This one's a little long for right now. There we go. Now I'm just going to put a little Mod Podge over top of everything to make it more permanent. And have a nice sheen. Then I'm going to dry this up and then continue with my dream card because I don't know. I could still have layers on it. I have no idea. But my next step will be to dry, to dry it up and then go from there. So here it is, all nice and this light is very shiny. It might be too much. I don't know, the light seems to be 
Ugh, bugging me. Alright, as I was saying, it is um, all nice and glued, and it's nice now. And for Dream, I don't know. Just play with it a little bit more. I think so. Maybe I'll add some. This is um, like this is the flower papers. It's kind of funny because I'm looking down and I have a thicker cardstock. Um, this was like kind of a plasticky paper or a thick, really thick cardstock that I was using for my jelly prints. And I actually think I might add a couple of flowers that are just going to be inked. Just for the heck of it. Because it's my dream card. And I can dream. So there's my flowers. I like them. And then I put that back in my stencils. Um... I'm just going to keep going with that. Um, got maybe one more? No, I don't know. Even, but you know what I'll do is I'll put a little part one right there. There we go. So there it is. gonna maybe add some music notes I'm not sure how well they're gonna stick up because they're not gonna be really good with this textured background but I might get a couple pieces of notes in there. So, and I'm just going to go like this and try to get them on there. I like that. Music's kind of dreamy, you know, it helps you dream. And you so, there's, oh, I like that. And things don't really match up in your dreams either, so that's pretty cool. Let's see, I think I might even put... Oh, where did I put my other clock? Because I would have liked that one, it was smaller. Hmm. I might just put some clocks and stuff like that in here. Because time and, and stuff like that in your dreams. I could put some gears. I have to paint them up. Because your mind just works, right? Oh, and there's, I have a little lock here. I could put a little lock on there because you can't. You know, sometimes our minds are locked, things are locked away and we can't think about them or, like, bring them out without, but they come out in our dreams. So that'd be cool. Well, I'm having fun with this one. We have a key. I don't know if I want the key, even though there's a lock in that one. So, I think I might like that. And, um, you 
guys. I'm not sure. I might have somebody's kind of moved around in there. I'm going to have to paint this up and um, add it to my dream card. Okay, I've decided to go a little different way. I thought the gears were just too much, but I'm going to do the one. And then I'm going to do some of these mirrored sequence type things because I think they're really cool and you know how you know you look in the mirror and you see different things and just dreams and mirrors kind of seem to go with me so I like that so I might even actually take some of the sequence and throw it in here too just because I want to and I think I will. I'm going to grab my other scissors I'm going to cut this up. And add the sequence to it just to have a really cool look. So now I'm going to put some of these. Um, I've gotten a gift in Happy Mail. And they are just sequence. And I'm going to use the red, definitely, um, and I guess I can almost use all the colors because they're all in here just to pull up some of the things. I'm going to regularly glue this because I don't want the hot glue to melt it because I think it's plastic. Oops. And then, and then I'm going to, um, put the maybe maybe hot glue the other ones I don't know Let's see the hot glue might help them hold a little bit better so I think I'm going to use black yellow blue red so that's I need more up there um four for sure and a purple so I'm going to do five And I'm going to have Dream in the middle, so it's going to be right there. One, two, three, four, five. And I think that's really, I was just like, I haven't used these, so yeah, that's pretty fun to use these. Oh, which orange do I want? I think I want this bright orange. Did I choose orange? I think so, for sure. Let's try different colors here and see what I want. Um, I'm going to use the reddish color because it really comes out. I want the blue. I wish we had more of the blue and perhaps the green, actually. No, maybe the orangey color. So I'm just going to add a tad of hot glue to those ones, I think. Then I'm going to add Dream. For this one, I think I'm just going to throw that on top of that. And same here. And that's where I'm going to have it. I might put this one a little higher up. Scrape the glue that's behind there. But this is it, guys. So um, as soon as I get my glue, it's just a little warmer. Let's check how it is here. And as soon as my glue is a little warmer, I'll well, throw on some eye moving my thing. Throw on some hot glue. This is crazy. Um, and okay, I see I'm letting it dry now. Throw on my hot glue. And. I'm going to add a little bit more just because for now I let that cool. Throw on my dream word. And I don't know if this is like a plastic or paper. I can't really tell because some people, I think it's plastic. So that's why I'm just going to, just didn't want it to have any behind and warp it. 
and then but the cloth the material on these ones are gonna be a little harder to to glue wet glue on them. I'm gonna pick all the strings off after. And really would have liked that to be in the navy blue. And knocking everything down. <laughs> okay. The cord is getting tangled around. So now, this is it for that. Um, I'm just putting that on the edge. I just find that one a little too... the other one. Is that dreamy? It's my dream. I want to put something more like bigger on there, but I don't want to make it too f thick. Hmm. Maybe some bling. I found some bling. I'm a very messy desk this time. <laughs> very messy desk. But that was because I was making little tile things. Now I'm going to save those. I don't know um, where I'm going to put them on. But I'll just put them some way away. Now, I'm just going to put the bling on. Um... Maybe I'll do a few here. Something a little different. And then I'll get my little I'm gonna use a little hot glue because there's some texture on here. it will stay and oh, come on oh that's hot that is hot one more piece There's my dream card. Thanks, guys. I'll probably do some doodling and that kind of thing on it, but you'll see it later. <laughs>